It is the dawn of a new day. The gentle sun's rays touch the rugged shoulders of the mountains in the Jordan Valley. While the soft breeze from the nearby shores of the Dead Sea dances through the air, carrying with it the whispers of history and the promise of adventure. From here, our journey begins. Our journey began amidst the ruins of Al Alja village and its rushing torrents, where we encountered the Gray Shrike, a resident bird that calls the Jordan Valley its home. Considered one of the largest types of shrike in Palestine, this remarkable bird feeds primarily on small birds, mice, and reptiles. At first glance, the gray shrike may appear to be just a handsome and fluffy songbird, but one should not be deceived by its innocent face. Behind its charming facade lies a fearsome predator known as the Butcher. This title is rightfully earned, for the Gray Shrike employs a barbaric hunting style that leaves no room for mercy. It captures its unsuspecting prey and carries it swiftly, only to tear it apart on barbed nets or branches of sharp and forked trees. With a beak reminiscent of raptors, the gray shrike exudes confidence, standing steadfast and composed in its surroundings. We continued our journey north to the village of Fasail. This village serves as a resting stop for migratory birds on their arduous journey from Europe to Africa. These are the black kites. These migratory birds grace us with their presence during the autumn migration, and as winter descends, approximately 8,000 black kites choose Palestine as their winter sanctuary. These birds exhibit a graceful flight style, reminiscent of a kite as they effortlessly glide through the air. Their flight is aided by the unique shape of their tail, allowing them to maneuver with precision and elegance. With a combination of white, black, and brown hues, this bird may appear black due to dim lighting or distance, hence its name, the black kite. Surprisingly, a peculiar sight unfolds amidst the flock of black kite. It is a white stork, Were you expecting an attack? Prepare to be surprised as black kites rarely engage in hunting and often scavengers feasting on food scraps and carcasses. It appears these birds have formed a unique camaraderie, flying harmoniously together. The white stork is a magnificent bird with long legs spanning up to 120 centimeters. It typically exhibits a social nature, but this bird seems in a solitary moment, standing alone away from its group. Here it arches its neck backward and emits enchanting sounds through its beak to communicate with its flock. The white stork embarks on its autumn migration through Palestine en route to Africa. It travels in vast flocks, providing a valuable service to farmers by devouring agricultural pests along its rest stops. Come spring, these migratory birds return to their original habitats, ready to embark on a new breeding season. As we embarked on our return journey to the captivating Dead Sea, we sought solace amidst the serene ambiance of a date palm plantation. Eager to find respite, we gently placed our luggage down, 
only to be greeted by the enchanting sight of the elusive sand grouse bird near a tranquil water pond. Known for its cautious nature, this remarkable bird embarks on arduous journeys across the arid regions of the valley in search of life-sustaining water sources. Amongst the scene, two sand grouse's males captivated our attention. One, an adult, stood watchfully, his keen eyes surveying the surroundings, while the other, a young male, gracefully descended towards the water pool to drink. The young male, having satisfied his thirst, took the place of the adult, diligently monitoring the area until the adult quenched his own thirst. With its shy and cautious nature, the sand grouse bird remains a challenging sight to behold. With a swift drink, the adult male quickly took flight. In the majestic embrace of the Jordan Valley, the mountains stand as guardians of time, weaving a tapestry that unravels the secrets of bygone eras. The Dead Sea unveils its captivating beauty as waves crash upon its crimson banks, while palm trees align like artists, their brushstrokes painting a vivid canvas that echoes the timeless tales of generations who have traversed this sacred land.